welcome to Malibu Dolls. This is Reviews and Unboxing, and today I will be reviewing and unboxing the 2006 Holiday Barbie. As it is now the holiday season, I thought it would be the perfect opportunity to make yet another Holiday Barbie doll review. This doll was released on June 1, 2006 under a black label. The doll designer is Bob Mackey, an American fashion designer. His amazing taste in fashion allowed the production of some of the most glamorous and unbelievably stunning Barbie dolls ever made. Bob Mackey is by far my most favorite designer out there. This was his second holiday Barbie, the first one being produced in 2005. Although this doll is no longer available for purchase on the official Barbie website, it is easy to find her on retail websites including eBay for a reasonable price. I have received this doll as a gift and have taken her out of the box prior. The box is fairly large and is very festive. The doll is framed by a shiny gold outline with stars and swirl-like design. At the top, the year of the doll's production is indicated. In the lower half of the box, the words Holiday, Barbie are written in a fancy font. Below, Bob Mackey's signature is present. At the bottom of the frame, it is indicated that the doll is part of the Barbie Collector Collection. On both sides, there are more festive designs. On the back is an eye-catching, beautiful sketch of the doll signed by Bob Next Mackey. So the illustration is a smaller photograph of Bob Mackey, most likely in 2006, as he looks significantly different today. At the top is again the year, the name, and the signature of the doll's designer. To the right, there are a few paragraphs about the beautiful celebrations of the winter holidays, brief characteristics of the doll, as well as a little bit about Bob Mackey himself. All of the words and graphics are surrounded by magical stars. At the bottom, there is some information about the producer and an indication that the doll was made in Indonesia. Let's take this beautiful doll out of her box. She also came with the black saddle doll stain and her certificate of authenticity. The doll is absolutely gorgeous. Her face is very vibrant and detailed. She has printed light blue eyes and long lashes. She has silver liner on her eyelid. Above the eyes, she has beautiful gold and sparkly eyeshadow. The eyeshadow reaches her light brown eyebrows. The doll has bright blush and glitter pink lips. In both ears, she has unique dangling star earrings. They may not be taken out of the head. This holiday Barbie has a long braided hair braided into a beautiful braid. It is secured with nonstick gel. On top of the hidden bands, the braid is fastened with a string hair part. She also has something known as a widow's peak. On the head, she has a beautiful crown that is known as a kakoshnik in Russia. It is made of velvet material and features shiny gold and silver stitching. In the center is a plastic star. On the back, it is stitched together. The dress is unbelievably creative. The doll has a unique fox fur shoulder addition. It can be worn in several different ways. The fur itself is very soft. The dress is composed of a black velvet material. The corset features a zigzag-like neckline with similar gold and silver stitching. In the center is the same plastic star as seen on the crown. The corset and skirt are separate parts of the dress that connect at the back. The dress can be taken off, however, the fur shoulder accessory may not. The skirt is absolutely beautiful. The stitching almost forms a design that looks like a Christmas tree. Throughout, there are various multicolored stars. At the top and sides is again the little silver stars. All through the bottom edge, the dress features the fur detail. The only downside of this gorgeous dress is little particles easily stick to the velvet material. It is hard to show the legs of this doll because of the stiff skirt. However, she does have silicone legs that each bend back on two clicks. She also came with a pair of shiny gold shoes. I hope today's video of reviews and unboxing was interesting. Personally, I really love this doll and completely recommend her. Comment whether or not you share a similar passion for dolls designed by Bob Mackey, and I will see you really soon. Bye!